Jules here. Welcome to our channel. So in case you haven't saw or heard before, um, we spent five years on the road in full-time RVing and had to come off the road and we had to get a house, which we are renting it currently. Um, but we missed the road so much that I am preparing to SUV camp. We have an upcoming, our first upcoming camping trip this weekend. And so I'm going to be getting ready and doing some prep work. This right here, this is Reflectix and I'm gonna be using it today to make window covers for the SUV. So I already made two right here and um, I will show you in just a few minutes. They fit in the back passenger windows. So I'm going to take you guys over here and show you what I did with the other ones that I made really quick. So this window here, I don't know if you can see it, so I'll go ahead and turn the camera around. So this window here, let me, I don't remember if that's the way I did it, yeah. So, so I didn't put any kind of velcro or magnets or anything like that it's just sitting in the window all by itself so now i'm going to do this window here and the other one on the other side um it's a pretty tight fit i don't know if you can see the wind the sun is kind of glaring quite a lot that is a pretty good fit there So I finished this window and I'd say it's a pretty good fit. Um, I might could trim a little off right there, maybe, but too much is better than too little in this case, I think. Um, so it fits pretty good. So both of these windows will now be covered. So what I use for this is this little cutter right here. I kind of traced around like that to get a good line for it and then I used the regular scissors to cut where I had traced around so there we go now I've got to finish the back window I've got to finish the other side and the two front but I did buy a visor to go on the front windshield well, this right here is what I had to do in the back because as you can see this window and I've got See that copper wiring? That's my little lights that I'm gonna have for romantic moments. But that window has entirely too much going on up there. So what I did was I just hung a curtain in the back here instead. And I may put a little piece of like black felt right there, depending on what my hubby thinks about this set up as far as privacy goes we'll see okay so i think i've got the windows finished but i'm going to show you guys real quick you can kind of see that window's done that window's done the windshield up there, I have a armor all um, covering that goes up there. You know, like you see, it's Reflectix as well. So let me show you real quick. So here's this window. And then as you come in the car, I'll have something there. Ignore my car, it's kind of messy. <laughs> we had the grandkids in here this weekend, so we got the car seats. But um, so that every window is covered. Now there's a little crack in that one over there. I just, I need to push it back in a little bit. But see my lights, I got my lights going and all the windows are covered and the curtain is up and the lights are on. So I think I have everything done 
you see the little hole you'd have to really get up in there to see it but anyway um, we've done a lot of other things too that we're gonna show you when we actually go on our camping trip we've ordered some stuff um, mattress some like a screen tent a tent for our toilet in case you're curious of how we're gonna use the bathroom in the middle of the night because the campground will have a bathroom but we're getting older and we have to sometimes go in the middle of the night so um anyway looking forward to showing you guys everything looking forward this this camping trip is going to be a trial run for us so that we can kind of test things out and see what works what doesn't work that kind of thing so you guys don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed to our channel um follow us along who knows what's gonna happen i don't know what's gonna happen but um i'm looking forward to the adventure and the journey and uh yeah go ahead and hit that like button as well all right if you're still breathing there's still hope